Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, I'm going to show you how to enable all the new features from the moment to update on Windows 11 22H2. And in this video, of course, we're talking about the release preview channel. In a previous video, I told you that Microsoft is starting to prepare the moment to update for Windows 11 22H2 already on the release preview channel. And these new features are hidden for now in the release preview channel. This moment to update for Windows 11 22H2 could come up somewhere early next year. So until then, we can manually enable those features to test them out in the release preview channel of the Windows Insider program. In this video, of course, I'm going to show you how to do that. If you enjoy videos like these where I show you how to enable different hidden features or different updates in Windows 11, don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. Of course, first of all, you're going to need to download Vive Tool, which is a tool that lets you enable different hidden features in Windows 11. We're going to have the download link in the article below in the video's description. All you need to do is to go and click on that link and download the latest version of 5tool.zip. You can open it with the default extracting tool from Windows 11 and then you just have to click on extract all, click on browse and look for the system32 location which would be this PC, local disk C, Windows and then scroll down to system32, select it, click on select folder and then click on extract. I'm gonna have to replace the files in the destination because I already did that but no issue, just click on continue a few times and Vive tool should be completely set up on your system. Now, after we've set up Vive Tool, you will need to open up the search box, type in there CMD, and then click on Run as Administrator. On user account control, click on Yes. In CMD, you're going to have a few commands that you'll have to enable. First of all, to make sure that all the different features and hidden features will work, we're going to have to enable this command. Just copy and paste it, and you should receive the message successfully set feature configuration. Don't forget that all the commands and also what every command does will be listed in the article below in the video's description, the first link. One of the first hidden features is different search visuals. So you can enable this using this command and by changing the variant, you have three options, one, three, or five. For example, I'm gonna choose five and then press enter. We also have the tablet optimized taskbar and new system tray. Run this command and again, you should receive the message successfully set feature configuration. Also, we have the updated tray overflow area with the rearrange icons and so on. Also, we have the new live file explorer search and also a hidden feature from the settings app, which will allow you to show the touch keyboard within a drop down and settings of course. After you run all of these commands, you're going to have to restart the system for the changes to take effect. I'm going to do that right now. So now after the restart, we should have all the new features enabled. First of all, we have the different search variant here that we enabled, the fifth variant, and as you can see, it's pretty nice. A wider search box with a nice gradient. Once you click on it, we also have the tablet optimized taskbar and if we right click and click on taskbar settings and taskbar behaviors, we should see this new option, optimize taskbar for touch interactions when this device is used as a tablet. When automatically hide the taskbar is also selected, touch optimize taskbar will show instead. Also, a lot of changes you will notice if you have a touch display. And also the new system tray with rounded corners and of course the updated tray overflow area. Rounded corners, the ability to rearrange icons and nice little animations when you move icons to the system tray and then hide them. We also have the live file explorer search as I've said, so let's just test this out. If we type something, File Explorer should automatically search for something while we're typing. And as I've said, another hidden feature that we may encounter in the moment to update from the next year can be located in accessibility, keyboard, and then typing in your half year touch keyboard and show the touch keyboard with a drop down, never when no keyboard attached, and always, which is pretty interesting in my opinion. As I've said, the download link for Vive Tool and all the commands used in this video will be in the article below in the video's description. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe for the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.